In this video we're going to look at the visualisation question 4. This is 9 marks, so you need to get as many marks as you can for this. The question says, create a visualisation diagram of the reward screen of the smartphone health app. Marks rewarded for content, layout, fitness for purpose, annotations to justify. So what we're looking at for this, for 9 marks, 7 to 9 marks, mark band 3, just have a quick look at this. So, for nine marks, content relevant to mobile health app reward screen. Use of inclusion of images and buttons, white space, suitability of layout, color schemes, fonts, promotional style, persuasive language. Um, so, we'll look at this paper then. So, first thing we're going to write on the top is visualization diagram now for this I've got a pencil and a ruler and I recommend you do the same as well for that and I'm just going to draw myself an outline of what an average smartphone might look like obviously a bit smaller than this but I just want to fill the page and leave myself some space on the side some annotations and some writing. So when I think about a smartphone app for awards, I'm thinking at the top I need to have, I'm going to have a band there and I'm going to have a button with looking like this. So when I click on that, it takes me to more info. So I'm going to actually spell this out. So right button for user to click for further details slash account etc. Now I'm going to write the title up there progress walk And what I want on, on this right hand side is um, a little space for the account balance. So that's going to be um, total points, account balance. Balance, spell it properly. Right, that's going to be orange. So I'm spelling out the colours here. I'm going to have that orange. Um, this is going to be white. I don't think you can put too much detail on this. Um, I'm really spelling everything out, and nothing, nothing is left to chance, or or they'll know that, or just assuming. There's no assumptions here. So that I'm going to write the font San Serif font. I don't know what font. I can't, I'm in my exam, I can't think what fonts I've got, I can't really remember any, any, but if I remember the word sans serif, that means a modern font, it hasn't got any serifs on, on it, it looks modern, so I think that would suit my app quite well. And I'm going to have a white background there, I'm going to keep it nice and simple. And in this middle bit here, what I thought would look really good is if I have a circle. Now I'm going to have to draw this freehand as best I can. I haven't got access to anything to draw a circle in my exam. It's an IT exam, not math, so I haven't got a compass or anything like that. I don't want to worry too much about that. I just I just want to have, I thought what would look really nice if I have this circle here, okay, and maybe an, an arrow there like that. And this is white, black outline, and this is green, and in the middle I've got, in big writing, my points total, so that would be um, big. So what's this about? It's it's about um, 
one of the points on the mark scheme. Um, this is a reward screen. Um, it's got to sell sell this product. Um, people are going to get interested in this if they have their points in nice big writing. They can see the improvement there. They can see that going up. They're going to win something from that. So it says promotional style. This is part of promotional style. So I'm going to spell that out to the examiner. So points total for promotional style. Again, as I said to you before, you cannot be subtle with this. You need to spell everything out for maximum marks. So I've got my points total green. Um, what does this arrow do? The arrow represents total points. So when it obviously gets around to there, then I've got loads and loads of points. Okay, so that's representing total points there. Right, down the bottom, it says something about buttons, so I think I'm going to have a few buttons there. Um, I'm not measuring this out, I'm just doing it freehand. Um, like I said to you, have got plenty of time, but I don't, I'm not going to get any more marks for doing it. It's exactly two centimetres wide each button, not going to gain any more marks for that. Down the button, I've got... Um, just going to spell out, these are buttons. Cannot just assume the examiner will know that. And these buttons are going to be, um, I think this one's going to be green. I think um, they're all going to be green actually. So that's going to be claim reward. So that is a button to claim reward. That is a button for account. And that's help. Now, excuse the writing there. I try and write it a bit more neat, but I'm trying to get this done quickly because um, we're already at seven minutes and we need to get this done. So that's my buttons down the bottom there, and I've got the white space there. So I'll just, again, spell that out. White space. So if I go look at, back at this quickly before I finish off. So it is a reward screen. So if I write in nice big writing there, um, progress walk, it doesn't actually say rewards on there, so I think I'll put rewards, nice and big. Uh, images and buttons, yes. White space, yeah. Suitable for layout, I think so. Um, color schemes, yeah, I'll put color schemes on there. Um, fonts, sizes, types. Um, I haven't really sort of spelt out exact fonts, but I put sans serif fonts, so gain some mark there. And sizes, I'll just put big and small, really. Promotional style, persuasive language. I think that is quite persuasive. Points total, and I've written there promotional style, and then brackets persuasive. Okay, so really, really spelling that out to the examiner. Um, Content, layout, fitness for purpose, annotation to just justify design decisions. Yeah, I think I've got all that in there, and that hopefully gave me nine marks. I'm quite pleased with that. If you think that looks good, a bit of common sense, does that look good to you? Would you like that? Would you would that make you want to walk more and gain more rewards? Then I think um, if yes, then um, you gain the marks there. So that's that.